Hi everyone, I'm Marcy Marcusa, host of Information Radio on CBC Radio 1. Thank you for your interest in working with us here at CBC Manitoba. We're hopeful that the tips and ideas in this video will guide you and help you as you prepare your application to come and work with us. I've worked here at CBC Manitoba since 2001, and the thing I absolutely like the best is that every day is a little different from the last, and I learn something every day, which keeps me on my toes and makes for great radio. CBC Manitoba is a great place to kickstart your career in media. You'll work with people with diverse perspectives, we have great employee benefits, and you can grow your passion, whether it's in television, radio, web writing, technical production, and more. The best piece of advice that I got when I got started in media was to be yourself. I mean your real self. Don't form a thought about what you should act like or be like. Who are you? And share that with us. You got this. Hi, Kamusta, Faith Fundal. Before joining CBC in 2008, I worked as a researcher, a reporter, a newsreader, and producer in Vancouver, Kamloops, and Prince George. And then in 2020, December, I joined CBC Manitoba to become the host of Up to Speed on CBC Radio 1 during a global pandemic. Moving to a new city can be daunting, but what attracted me to Winnipeg was the opportunity to grow at a CBC station right at the heart of the continent. There's access to an abundance of local arts, culture, music, and theater, and of course, supportive colleagues in current affairs. Here at CBC, we're committed to reflecting a contemporary Manitoba through the stories that we have the honor of sharing and through the diversity of our province, which includes our workforce. That's because we can only create and share stories that connect Canadians by having a workforce that mirrors the ever-changing demographics of this country. We encourage and welcome people of all backgrounds to apply for job opportunities at CBC Manitoba. Hey there, I'm Lisa Sychuk, Senior Specialist in the Talent Acquisition Team with People and Culture at CBC Radio Canada. I have read many cover letters and resumes during my time here at CBC. I'm here to take your good cover letter and resume and make them into great ones. Here are my top five tips to get your application to stand out from the crowd. Use your cover letter to really express what excites you about the opportunity. What are your strengths and what are you hoping to learn in this role? Be sure to hook in the manager and recruiter. With a good hook, we will want to keep reading your cover letter as well as your resume. Do your homework. If you're not from the location, contact members of the newsroom. What do they like about this particular location? Who are the managers? Be sure to contact them and ask for a 10 minute chat. You're not part of CBC yet? Research our corporation. What are our mission, our values, and what we need to accomplish as the public broadcaster? If the opportunity asks for a demo, be sure to include this in your application. Make your resume succinct and to the point. It should be bullet points of what you did at each point in your career, personal accomplishments, or academic achievements. Read what you are submitting thoroughly. No one wants to see spelling errors on a cover letter or resume. Remember, read the job posting from start to finish. The average candidate reads a posting for approximately seven seconds. Understand the job that you're applying for. This is the next part of your career. Thanks for choosing to apply with CBC Radio Canada. I look forward to meeting you in an interview soon. I'm Gillian Taylor, executive producer of news for CBC Manitoba. I've been working here as a journalist since 2012. And what I love about working here is not only the people inside the newsroom, but also the Manitobans who allow us to share their stories. Journalism is an important industry and we have the ability to reach people across the province and the country through our powerful storytelling. I'm so happy that you've decided to apply with us and say you've made it through the selection process. Here are my top three tips for you going into an interview. Come prepared. Be ready with examples of why you're right for this job. What skills do you have to make you the right candidate for this position? Do your research. Review the show or position that you're applying for and demonstrate you have knowledge of that program or beat and showcase your critical thinking skills. Take your time. Interviews can be a little intimidating. Take a deep breath, take a sip of water, and pause. Take your time when you're answering questions. Don't be shy in asking them to rephrase the question or repeat it if you need to hear the question again. Bring your notes if that helps. Hi, I'm Nadia Kidwai, Senior Producer of Community Connection here at CBC Manitoba. I started here at 
2016, I've done a few different positions during my time here. I began as host of the weekend morning show and then I did a secondment as an executive producer for diversity and inclusion. I hope that you found this short video useful with some practical tips on how to apply for a position here at our station. We also have a lot of opportunities, especially for Manitobans from diverse communities who are interested in journalism as a career but haven't had any formal experience or training in a Canadian newsroom before. CBC Manitoba's Pathways program is a full-time, paid, five-month development opportunity for up to five Indigenous, Black or other people of colour candidates to learn the essential elements of working as a reporter in the CBC newsroom. Indigenous Pathways is a full-time, nine-month learning and development opportunity for six First Nations, Inuit and Métis candidates who want to develop practical skills as a storyteller in a CBC newsroom. There is no requirement for prior journalism experience. The CBC Abilicru Placements for Excellence is a six-month paid placement program for professionals with disabilities who are early in their careers who have not yet worked at the CBC. And finally, CBC Manitoba's Community Advisory Board provides insight into the way our station covers the province. The board helps ensure that CBC Manitoba authentically represents the diversity of experiences, stories, concerns and achievements of the communities we serve. Board members are appointed for two-year terms and are invited to share their opinions and perspectives, inform about issues and provide feedback about CBC Manitoba's content and coverage. Good luck with your application and we hope to work with you someday.